Hey everyone, this is Kyle from Tech Lingo, and earlier this week we were actually fortunate enough to attend one of Intel's latest announcement event, the 6th generation Intel processor codenamed Skylake. So this is actually a 14 nanometer processor with uh, improved performance as well as better power efficiency at about 3 times longer compared to previous models 5 years ago. And of course, with this we can actually see laptops that you know could actually be slimmer and as well as lasting longer even though battery technology hasn't really been improving the past few years. Moving on, right at the event there was also Aftershock PC. This is actually a local company here in Singapore formed about 3 years ago in a small shop in Serangoon. And their main focus is actually to build high-end custom notebooks in the Singapore market which is actually very similar to what the US already has. And right now they have many many different type of uh, fully customizable laptops and as well as desktops right now. So you can, if you're looking for a mid-level performance or a really high performance laptop they have all different kinds of customized solutions right there for you and as well why are they even there this event it's because they are going to be one of the first companies in Asia to be introducing the latest 6th generation Intel processor into their notebooks yes you heard it right right here in Singapore you can actually head down to their shop get your own customized solutions and you'll be actually running the latest hardware by Intel and that is definitely exciting to know that you can actually find something like this in Singapore. You know, Aftershock has also impressed us with some of their latest test results um, with improved thermal. So you can actually um, look at laptops that run lesser heat, uh, about 10 degrees lesser than older models. Of course, with the latest processors, definitely going to have high performance and a lesser battery consumption so you can last longer on a single charge. The laptops produced by Aftershock PC also has a battery charge cycle feature which um, actually means that when your laptop is actually plugged in and when it reaches a certain percentage, maybe at 90 or 99 percent, it will actually stop charging and this will help prevent overcharging. And of course, with the new chipset Refresh, um, it definitely comes with updated capabilities. So you have things like the 64 GB RAM and as well as support for USB 3.1, offering true 10 GB per second performance. And as well as it supports you know, SSD storage solutions with over 2 GB per second speeds, yes, on your SSD. So look forward to you know running games, applications really, really fast. If you're looking at a desktop, it definitely comes with a G-Sync option if you add in an additional cost, maybe about $50 if I'm not wrong. And what G-Sync actually does is that you know with your NVIDIA graphic card, it will sync the refresh rate with your GPU and monitor. So your graphic card and monitor would both you know refresh the frame at the same time so yeah definitely smoother animations on your screen with that being said this is something you know pretty exciting to hear about in Singapore especially with Aftershock PC having new Intel processors doesn't necessarily mean that you can head over to like Challenger or Harvey Norman or any other hardware stores that uh, you can find laptops from Asus or HP, you know, that runs the latest Intel. But if you're, you know, interested in doing that, yes, head over to Aftershock PC. You definitely can get your customization options and, you know, build one computer that fits you, you know, that fits your style and as well as run the latest Intel processors and, you know, the latest of latest everything, you know, with RAMs, with USB, and, you know, definitely you can game on it, you know, you can show it off to your friends. And yeah, that is something I would actually consider personally. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed our update about the latest Intel processors as well as what you can actually get right here in Singapore. So do leave us comments down below uh, if you have any feedback or improvements you know, that we can actually make. With that, um, this is Kyle signing off.